morning guys out here off Nora Head again and geez a bit blowy today just doing a little drift with some Pananoska rigs um, caught a few fish already in the esky it's a bit bloody um, cold this morning a bit dark so only just doing the intro now but we've already got quite a few good fish in the esky which is good we're going to be getting some plastics out as well today just drifting with them and hopefully trawl some lures around the bomby again, pick up some kings or anything. We'll see what happens. It's pretty good fishing out here, you always do well. But Jake's and I know a good fish first of the morning on the soft plastic. I haven't even bloody got my line in the water and he's freaking on to a fish. Cheeky bugger. Anyway, let's see what he gets. I'm gonna chuck, chuck a soft plastic on my spare right here. Seeing so that looks like it's working. I'd say he's got a nice little snapper or something. Oh yeah. Keep it the same old size as this last time, maybe a bit bigger. Uh, not a bad yeah. start in the morning. Yeah. That bit over the kilo size again. Bloody beautiful. <laughs> I haven't even got a line in the water. Bloody hell. Ah, oh, better get going. Alright, I'm gonna go. Oh, not perfect hook up there. I'm gonna go get a gulp five inch paddle tail on there. Something different. What have we got here? 28 meters depth here. Oh, it's early. Didn't bring a jumper, didn't bring any socks. Feet are freezing. Woo! Oh, that's a good fish. Well, look at the ticks. It's not a snapper, eh? Still a bit. <laughs> oh, double hookups. Oh, I don't know what I've got here. There's some good tail kicks going there. Beautiful yeah, Sergeant Baker. Not bad fish. Got here. Maybe a mobile or something. It's a bit of an unusual fight. Ooh, it's not giving up, which generally means it's a good one. Got here. Yep, a Maui. I picked it. Picked it well, I did. On the bottom of it. <laughs> he's, he's guts. Oh, yeah, he's, he's been. Oh, look at that for a Maui. Big bloody sucker. Beautiful fish they are, the Maui's. And he just slipped him. And he just got him on. Just using four O's here. But geez. Good. Not a bad Maui for the first one in the morning. Isn't he beautiful? Not very impressive, his little stomach hanging out there. Only 28 metres, I'm surprised it came out. It's over 80, you know what I mean? Anyway, we'll let him go. Let him pick that, didn't I? That was more as big as that last one, you know. Mm. That was a cracker. They put up sort of an unusual fight. It's almost like a trevally, and then it's sort of goes in the more heavier sort of kicks. I'll get one more fish and I'll put the bait on. You like the look of that one, did you? Yeah. Oh, another good fish. Oh! Oh, it feels like another big Maui. <laughs> oh, not bad for the second hook up. Yeah, I think it's another Maui. Bloody hell. On the Maui grounds. Go <laughs> the way. I'm not sure what I got here actually. I think it's a Maui. It's maybe not. Yeah, another Maui, just not as big as the last one. Jeez, they go hard, these Mowies. They really do go hard. 
gorgeous fish. There they are. All right, I'll let him go again. Oh, oh, what says I hit it? Smash me. Well, that's snappery. That's a bit snappery. Look at that camera. Yeah. Yeah, as soon as I hit them, I wasn't even on the bottom for five seconds. Feels a bit snappery. I don't know how big he is, but I think he's not bad. He's still kicking. Yeah. He's a panty. What do you got? Uh, He's a panty. Jeez, they're fat around here, eh? I don't know what they're feeding on. They're getting a good old feed, but good plate size. We'll add him to the esky. Oh, <laughs> it's non stop. <laughs> There's a hit. Jeez, there must be some fish down there, eh? Small one then, guys. Small one, but. Oh, even worse. Shake it, shake it, mate, shake it. Yeah, maybe. Bother with him, really. Ah, oh, it's a little fella. Probably 30, but too small for us. Oh, that's a better fish, mate. Oh, snap, snap. Oh, that's a big one. It's a big one there, mate. I'll wait to drop my line, I think. Give you a chance here. Might be the first. I'm not even taking line, it's taking line. Might be the first net job. Oh, yeah. I probably should put a line out because that's where another one would be. I'm glad this is the 5,000 reel. Better gonna free up that net. I reckon it'll be a net job this one. I reckon it can be a net. Good snapper. It's not really doing a lot of head, head nods. Shakes. You reckon mate, maybe a Maui. Big Maui. Oh, yeah, it's hard to... I can't even pick this. Interesting. Oh, yeah. Interesting. No, I think that's a snapper, mate. I think it's giving some head nods there. Top bite, I just got two. Give you like a ton of bricks. Nice snappy. That's really nice snappy. You're kidding. I just got drilled too. Look at that. Look at that. Bloody beautiful, mate. Look at that. Bloody beautiful. Get him in. Yeah. Oh, son. Nice few kilo there. Bloody beautiful. Oh, oh and I'm with you. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Mine's not really. Mine's a cod or something. Oh no, it's a fish. He was just paying, he's just mucking around with me, but Jason just landed a beautiful snapper. I'll give you a look at him in a second, but bloody line got wasted while I was looking at him. What do we got? Big flatty. Big flatty. Holy hell. <laughs> There's a different There's a different combo. A blue spot and a big bloody snapper. 
Look at the colours on that blue spot, would ya? Look at that, hold him up, mate. Woo! The snapper. That'd be awesome. Oh, well, there's a couple for the ice box. We're gonna need a big rescue, mate. <laughs> we might have to get a. I'll get. I might have to get the other camera out. No, oh, no, I got a good picture on that one. It's a bloody nice flathead. Oh well, good esky filler. You're real good esky fillers. Couple of nice ones there, mate. About a hundred bucks worth in one, two drops. Just a little snapper. Yeah, we'll go back in. Yeah, well, reefy bottom. And that's an inside breed leather jacket, not even the outside breed one. Good eating, but we'll take him. Tuna. <laughs> hey, I don't know what's going on with that. Oh, it's a, it's the biggest stripey, it's the biggest slimy I've ever seen. That is the biggest slimy. Look at that for a slimy. I thought it was. Just watch your camera, mate. I thought I was on the freaking tuna. It's a big slimy, but these are the best bait you can get. So, geez, I'm happy about that. Couple of slap baits on there. You ripper. Taylor or up on there. Maybe a tuna or something, mate. Something I've got a Javali. What do you got there? Javali as well. <laughs> Hooked him in the side. Might keep that one. Are your one? He's a bit bigger. Um, oh, I don't mind them for sushi. I might do a bit of sushi when I get home. Mine's a bit small, so I'll let him go. Yeah, that's why belt's not good. Is it a flatty? I hope it's a flathead. It's a flathead. <laughs> I hope it's a, it's a baker and a flathead. Oh, the flathead's all right. He's a keeper. Oh, the thing on the bottom, though. Yeah, the thing on the bottom, he can go. But always the blue spots are a pleasant, pleasant surprise. Maybe we should have a couple more baits, mate. Maybe we were just hitting the. Might be hitting the Yeah, getting to that 40 depth, I think. Jesus. Oh! What is going on here? Nah, it's no knobby. I feel it might be another Moe. I think it may be another Maui, but I'm a bit unsure about this one. A bit of weight here. A lot of weight. Ooh. Shit, what is that? Is that a flathead? Oh, man, that's a big flathead. Get the net, man. Get the net. Whoa, that is a big ocean flathead. That is, that is huge blue spot. Oh, <laughs> That's 70 centimetres, isn't it? Hey, you're going to be kidding me. Jesus. Oh, everyone, I always say you can get them up to 70. Well, there you go. I think he's close to freaking 70. That is a big blue spot. Holy shit. And a measurement on that one. You wanted another fish. <laughs> just, I just see the fire dealers are putting up. <laughs> you ripper. Yeah, just over 60, 60, 62 and a half centimetres. What an absolute ripper of a blue spot. It's so soft today. You'll get the spot. No, it's going to be that I do not want it to be this one. Then. Oh, river. That is a big blue spot. 
You don't often get blue spots. Whoa! You don't often get blue spots this big. But yeah, just goes to show. They put up a ripper of a fight when they get to this size. Look how thick he is. He is so thick. What a beauty. Alright, I'm gonna keep that one. Put him in the Yeski. A floaty? Oh, yeah. Get a bit forward line. Yeah. I think I got about the same sort. No, maybe even smaller. But it feels like a flatty again. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Hell. Chicken, They're onto the grounds now, one after the other. As we chuck them out, they're coming back in. Oh, shit, like that wind's kind of dying off a bit too, eh? By the tail beat to that, feels like a trevally. Yep. I keep him, he's a reasonable one. Keep him for sashimi, I won't do a catch and cook on that. I'm going to be the trevally. Just fish after fish. Both of us non stop pulling fish in. It's a shame they're not a bit bigger. They're just getting a lot around that 30 centimetre size today. A real lot. Ugh. It's non stop all day. Snap, snap, snaps all day long. No. <laughs> Still, no. Nah. Not big enough. <laughs> Small pan. <laughs> Hey, hit up the island. Nah, not trolling wise. Oh, I got this. Ooh. What have I got here? Unusual fight. Yeah. I might have a couple of fish or something on here. Can't seem to pick it. Oh, big flatty again, mate. Oh, flatty. Oh, you're on the uh, nah. I forgot, I forgot got you involved too, oh, I think. Not again. That's why I was a bit heavier. But, um, not a nice flathead there. Beautiful flathead. Oh, you bugger. I think I've, I think I've had enough anyway of this reef fashion. What about you? Yeah, let's go and use some fun. Trolling some lures, something different. I'll tell you what, absolutely smashed it as normal. I'm trying to get a drink out of my esky in here. I've got a can of drink in there somewhere, but I can't seem to find it. But, geez, we've got some nice fish in there. Beautiful big flathead, beautiful snappers. Just overall, just a good bloody haul of fish. That esky is near full. <laughs> but we must have. We must have thrown back at least 30 snappers each. They were just non-stop. They were just pretty much every time you hit the bottom, they're on the uh, lot of fish out here, but no real massive consistent ones today. We got some good ones, but yeah, not real big ones constantly. But I've got a few lures here, and we're just gonna go troll this bommy on the way back in, mix it up a bit, and just have a bit of fun. So we've got um I've got, yeah, I've got a skirt on that one, and I just got my usual spinner on that one. And we'll just go head into the bommy, we'll pick something up on the way in, we'll um, have a bit of fish around there, otherwise we'll call it a day. It's been a great day out here as always. Alright, let's go check that bommy out. Never know what you'll get around here. one get the trifecta let's see if I can get the trifecta here three squid oh yeah <laughs> trifecta Ooh, he's a fat one that one oh he yink me he's a bit bigger <laughs> he's a little bit oh he got me he got me a beauty oh no I think he, oh, he got me a beauty. Take the right. Oh, God. I reckon the sauce is good. It'll get me out of my face. 
Yeah, you could say that. You got me? There's not much left of your face, mate. Oh, you got me. Just a few black marks to suggest that you have. God, I've got to deal with these rods. Covered in ink. I actually think I had a little flatty sitting on that. Had weight. Mm -hmm. Morning guys. Geez, I'm looking attractive this morning. Face is covered in squid ink, nice and early. But yeah, we're out here with mate Jason. He's got a YouTube channel actually, Real to Meal. And we're just gonna be working some lures out here today. We've bagged ourselves four squid already. We've yet to get a fish. But I'm covered in ink, which is always a good start. Secret sauce is in play. Yeah, but very cold start this morning. Getting, getting um, close to nine o'clock and it's only just starting to warm up. So hopefully we can smash a few. Jason wants to take a couple of Taylor for bait. Um, we'll see how we go today. All right, let's get into it. Oh my God, it is pathetic, but it's the you know first what? one. <laughs> Look at that. This is the cutest little flathead. It's probably cold as anything too, oh. isn't it? Look at that. I've caught blue spots, plenty of them this size, but geez, this is a small little flathead. Absolutely pathetic. But he's cute, isn't he? He's a cute one. I don't get much smaller than that. Unless he's smiling shot. for the shot. Yeah. Good on him. Decent. You're right. Okay, nice one. You're right, little 35 or something. Yeah, nice little brim. He's demolished my bit of a waste of a live squid there. That, oh well, second fish. We broke the drought after the flathead and then five minutes after we got this guy. But geez, look at the little lump on his head. He's like a little snapper. Little brute he is. A bit of dominance right. happening there. Yeah, I'll let him go. See you, Brim. Oh. I think I mentioned a move time. Oh, it's a bit bigger. Ooh. Might be a tailor, I think, the way he's carrying. I want to know what's going on here, actually. I'm feeling a big tailor, but. Which is what? Jason's after. He wants one of these for for bait. So, oh yeah, perfect little tailor there. Chili bean. Yeah, Jason wants to use him for bait, so we'll keep this one. Put him in the esky. Oh, get me on the way there up. There we go. Yeah, tailor, <laughs> Jeez, yeah, mid water. Nice one. Collected there. Cheap bugger. Can't. Shame we got our fair share of these suckers today. <laughs> Working their magic. Well, I've kept us busy, I suppose. Oh, I'm on food. Oh, my squid. Oh, there's fish around here, mate. Oh, oh I just got busted off. He's nice. I just got busted. I just got busted off, mate. I'm a squid. Taylor. Taylor. Yeah. Good, good Taylor, but. Busted me clean off. I'm not putting another one down yet. I'm not putting another one down yet, that's for sure. Yep, clean busted. <laughs> you said it was only a small one, mate. Yeah, I always say that. Oh, do you? Is that your trick, is it? To make them bigger? Listen to that little real scream. This is a king's $29 job. It catches everything. This guy's just showing up to spend hundreds. Nothing wrong with a cheap setup. Yep. I don't want to pull a hook. Oh, yeah, mate. This yeah. is a tailor, by the way, not a kingfisher. Everyone just letting you know it's my first day ever chasing fish. <laughs> Looks like you got a good 40, but it's good. I don't know, maybe a 45er. Yeah, it's a nice one. 
It's a drag one. I don't want to pop him. Don't want to pop him. Not now. Jesus, I'm around. I just got bitten clean off on my live squid. <laughs> Would have been a big tailor too. One more run for the money. You reckon? Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Oh, thanks, Lukey. Last one. Jesus. Ripper, mate. Good 40, good 45er there. Maybe a tad over. Ripper. Yeah, push about 48. Hmm. Now let me get back to my vibe. Yeah, he's a good size. Yeah. Good size Taylor. Nice yeah. solid oh, fish. <laughs> <laughs> nice solid fish there. Anyway, first one mate. Have you broke the drought? I'm oh. Oh. oh, there we go. It's, it's, been spoken. it's, it's on the spot. It's happening now. Didn't even get to hit the bottom then and I got whaled. Feels like another reasonable one. He's coming in, might be a bit smaller than your one, I think. But we're in the, into the fish now, which is good. Yeah, not as big as yours, but still a nice one. Yeah, beauty. Okay. Oh, sorry about that. Camera went dead, but another beautiful tailor. Not quite as big as Jason's, but about 38 or something. Nice fish. Keep a few of these for bait. That's, that's going down if a Dewey sees it. Big hook out the top. Dewey baked dinner. Get him out there. No, if a tailor eats that, <laughs> it's a 90 centimetre tailor. There's, there's Jason telling me he's got a small one again. Oh, yeah. Look at them oh, oh. They're, they're chasing him. And these are all good sized fish. They're all that. They're all that 40 centimetre size. Oh, you're a legend there, mate. Slide into the net there. There we go. Bloody beautiful. Yeah. It's good fun catching these. Good bait, good to eat fresh. And good fun. On the light line, they're great fun. He's just getting them on a spinner there. Also, when it's quiet, at least you've got something to do. A little 20 gram, is it, or 15er? No, that's a 20. Yeah. I think it's 20. A little 20 grammer. Working well, that's about the profile size they're eating in here at the moment. Yeah. Bloody pack of jellyfish around here. I don't know if that means the fishing's good, but geez. Wasn't that many everywhere else. Came this little pack everywhere. Probably right. Then some. Oh, there we go, that's a Jew. Yeah, yeah, that's a Jew. What was that on? Not drawn. There we go. There we go. Been waiting for that one, the uh, midday Jew. It's ever reliable, the old Holtz. There you go. Small profile, but you know what? We'll pull down an 80 centimetre. Been waiting for that reel to run. Put that first that's run. Up on that, up on that side, mate. Get on the camera there. Alright. Get on the camera and. Gone. Oh no. Gone. Bugger. So it was eight pounds. Yeah. Did it snap you or just? No, nah, just about the book. I, just, I didn't want to rip it into the side of its mouth. Bugger. If I rip into it, she'll pop that 10 pound leader. So we'll give that another run. Yep. See the one um, Greg Norman caught when he was in America? No. I get it. Caught a shark. And then this tiger shark ate this other shark. A tiger? Yeah. Oh, what do you do with that? Oh, it was a tiger? I'm pretty sure it was a tiger. Yeah, yeah. And they he aggressive. pulled it up next to this boat. World record. <laughs> Huge, man. Of all people that get it, to Greg Greg Norman. Norman. <laughs> yeah, He's got yeah. it on YouTube. Yeah. yeah. Check it out. I'll have to look at that, yeah. yeah. it's pretty awesome. Okay. He was right in the wish fishing here, right? Yeah. Pretty sure him, him and Rex Hunt got into it a bit. Rex can get into the brothels a bit, I think. <laughs> that was his downfall. 
But it's a fish. It's a bit small. I don't know what he is. Flathead. Ooh. Playing coy he was. He's... It's very sad, but this is the flathead of the day. <laughs> Jesus, he's going to throw the hook here, is he? Oh, oh no. He's going to whip it? No, he's hooked well. He'd wrap him. Oh, God. He nearly bust me off on a spike. He's hey, beautiful. Oh, well, I'm starting to get a few fish. Let's get him back in. There's some bait fish for you, mate. They're waiting. Yeah. Get in on. Two on the way down. <laughs> Look at them scatter. Good job, this one. Just playing with this dead weight on this. Always nice first cast after, isn't it? Beautiful job. Get another one. Blood cut. Bite the dog on the last one. Not letting go. Oh, I hooked him in the back. I hooked him in the back. Oh. No wonder why you felt like a dead weight. Side flanker. Hey, no wonder why you felt like a dead weight. It's a flathead handbag going there. <laughs> There's some small ones around the day. The small ones around. Right, let him go too. It's unusual, mate. We're catching more fish now in the middle of the day than freaking. Yeah, you did actually predict that though. Yeah, don't you? You mean we could have slept in? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> like that. Sometimes you're going home and it's been the best fish in all day and you're like, shit, I should have just come for the Arvo session. It's all good. Yeah, uh, multi handy Luke up here. <laughs> He's got squid on one. Oh, they're everywhere. <laughs> must be about 10 down. Whatever reason, they're around and they're just hanging at the back of my uh, whole production lure. And squirt anything out. Beautiful. Oh, I said a 360. Jesus, small. Not much bigger than the, uh, the lure. <laughs> oh, single mantle. Get rid of the ink. Jesus. That's getting smaller. You can. Huge handy, that is. Oh, I just sighted you. <laughs> He's on. Oh! Tidy. Tidy. Are they getting smaller, mate? They're not going. <laughs> smaller and smaller and smaller. Hey, yeah, you can always call these bottle squid. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Give Tweet a run for their money, eh? Hey? <laughs> I tell you what, we'll be charging, but mm. yeah, hundred dollars a packet. <laughs> oh, we've got a pack of squid under the boat here. I'm going to see if I can trick him into this squid jig. Oh, there's four there, actually, mate. Oh, got him! Got him! <laughs> oh, it almost got me. Let's go again. A bit of tailor feels a bit tailory coming up like a oh what's a tailor oh <laughs> uh, yeah big boy is he gonna bite me off jeez i must have just lipped him <laughs> um, the salmon it's a salmon no it's not no it's a tailor it looked like it had tailored salmon colors but didn't it, it had that sort of look. What? oh good Double hook up here. Both of us went off at the same time. He's on the spin, I'm on the vibe. Oh, it's good fun. Nice one, mate. Good fun. GoPro needs design. An auto on feature when you go, ooh, ooh. Yeah, yeah, you push the wrong button, it should know. Oh. You go about the same size. Yeah, just a bit of a surface action there. There's your line, are you going to be right on him? Yeah, yeah, I'll be dragging him, mate. Good fun. Oh, well. Bit of plenty of bait in there now, mate. Oh, yeah. Pretty beautiful. Wonderful. They're all good sized tailor. Very healthy looking. They're all. F oh no. He's done me again, has oh, he? Oh gosh. He must nah. be just bumping it. Nah, it's alright. Right. Nah, it's alright. Still good. <laughs> Still good. Still good. Oh, bait fish. Alright, I'm gonna put a few of these out. Just landed that big boy. Jeez, he's a big one. On an 8 -o. 
up. Yeah, I was going for something decent with the freaking Ato hook and the live big squid on. Got a decent tail, but not what I was after. We got a fair few tailor and stuff and squid today. A few flathead. We let all that flathead go, but kept a few tailor for bait and the squid for bait and keep them for another time. Good sized tailors today, but they're all big suckers. All right, as promised, gonna be attempting some sushi here. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm very rusty. I had a practice roll before and it was a bit rough, but she came out. I've um, lost my bamboo roller, the professional one, so I'm just using some baking paper, which will do the job. And you want it shiny side down on your baking paper or on your bamboo sheet. And we've got the basic ingredients here running you through. There's that fresh trevally we got. Absolutely beautiful it is. It's great to eat fresh sushi or just to fry fresh. Very underrated fish trevally I reckon if you get it fresh and look after it. And we've got avocado, cucumber and chilli there. And we've just got a bit of water here to dip our fingers in, soya sauce and wasabi. Now wasabi's got a very bitey bite, so we're not going to go too heavy on that. Just a light, light smear on there. It's a quite powerful stuff. Quite a different kind of bite too, so it gets in your, in your nose a bit. All right, I'm going to start with some rice. A little bit dry so we're just going to moisten our fingers a little bit and that'll help not break through the paper and just keep the rice a bit moist to you don't want to dry rice when you when you're having your sushi but i i normally would just eat it like that personally i would just have a bit of soya sauce and um yeah i wouldn't muck around too much but this is a very nice way of um enjoying it Oh, how much do I put on? That's the question. We'll go about that. We'll go a generous serve of Trevally on here. Nice big serve. We'll get some chili. You can put whatever you like on there. Carrot goes quite nice on there. Capsicum, just something for a bit of colour is quite nice. I like the chili because it just gives it a little bit of bite. Bit of cucumber. Just for a bit of crunch on there. There we go. And then just the avocado. Okay. A little bit difficult without the rolling bamboo, but I think I'll manage with this. You just want to moisten the end so it sticks down. I'm just going to work that around. There we go. When we get it in position, you just want to hold it for about 5-10 seconds. Hopefully this turned out alright. Look at that. Quite firm actually. It turned out quite nice. Let's grab a knife, we'll give her a slice. Look at that. Turned out absolutely perfect. Check it out. Colours on it. Absolutely turned out perfect. I'm going to really enjoy that with a bit of soya sauce. In fact, I'll have a little bite now. I'd be rude not to have a bite and taste it. Soy in there. Really healthy way of eating it. Really nutritious. That's actually not too bad. It's better than the shop stuff. Really fresh. 
crunch of the cucumber is quite nice in there. That fresh trevally is absolutely beautiful on there. And the seaweed is quite nice too. There you go. Something different. It's good to try new things. And yeah, can't go wrong. Fresh fish. Very healthy for you. Good way of eating it. Alright guys. If you ain't fishing, you're wishing. And I'll see you on the water. Catch us.